Hi, I'm Julianne Cost. Here are 10 shortcuts for working with layer masks. To add a layer mask that reveals everything on the layer, click the Add Layer Mask icon at the bottom of the Layers panel. To add a layer mask to automatically hide the contents of the layer, hold down the Option on Mac or Alt on Windows and click the Layer Mask icon. To quickly delete a layer mask, we can drag the mask to the Trash icon and choose to either apply or delete the layer mask. However, I find it quicker to right-click or control-click on Mac on the Layer Mask and select Delete Layer Mask from the Context Sensitive menu. If you have a selection in your image, clicking the Add Layer Mask icon in the Layers panel creates a mask based on the selection. I'll use Command-Z on Mac or Control-Z on Windows to undo that. If I Option-click on Mac or Alt-click on Windows, the Layer Mask icon, I can add a layer mask to automatically hide the selection. If you ever need to invert a mask, use Command-I on Mac or Control-I on Windows. To move a layer mask, drag the layer mask thumbnail to another layer. To duplicate a layer mask, Option-Drag on Mac or Alt-Drag on Windows the layer mask thumbnail to create a copy. To reposition the mask or layer independently of one another, click on the link icon between the layer and the mask thumbnails to unlink the mask from the layer. Then select the layer mask and select the Move tool and reposition the mask. Or select the layer thumbnail to reposition the layer within the mask. To view a layer mask, option click on Mac or alt click on Windows the layer mask thumbnail in the Layers panel. Click the layer thumbnail or click the eye icon to view the layer. To display the layer mask as a red overlay, tap the backslash key. Tap it again to hide the overlay. To use the keyboard to target the layer or the mask, use Command-2 on Mac or Control-2 on Windows to target the layer, and Command-Backslash on Mac or Control-Backslash on Windows to target the layer mask. To temporarily disable a layer mask, shift-click in the Layer Mask thumbnail. Click the Mask thumbnail again to enable it. And finally, we can use the Properties panel to change the density of a layer mask, add a non-destructive feather to a mask, and refine the mask using Select and Mask or Color Range, and quickly invert a mask. I'm Julianne Cost. Thanks for watching.